We are prouder still that the White House wants to expand this initiative across the US government, like the Department of Defense, which has said that it needs to get cash off the battlefield to keep our soldiers safe. In Afghanistan, where police officers began to get paid through mobile money instead of a series of cash payments, they discovered that they had a 30% raise. They thought they got it actually from the mobile money company. But in fact, that was actually the amount of sticky fingers that were happening from the time the cash was deployed to the time they got it in their hands. A really important thing about this is when they were getting 30% less, they were getting paid less than the Taliban was willing to offer them to come to the other side. When they got that 30% raise, the money that they should have had in the first place, they were getting paid more than the Taliban was willing to offer them. So if we don't think that this has huge implications, not just for disaster, but for national security, as well as Americans to sell products overseas, the, the, the effect of this kind of payments platform and the efficiencies and opportunities are enormous. So moving from cash to electronic helps us helps our security, it creates new products, and makes the world uh, more uh, safe. 